What in the world is that? A lot of people ask me, what do I do to keep my batteries from corroding? Well, I've tried a lot of different stuff. There's a gooey spray that you can put on that's a little bit obnoxious. But uh, let's get back to basics here for a minute. When your car starts to rust, uh, what do you do? You get rid of all the rust, you get it down to good clean metal, uh, you do a little primer and then you paint it. And it's good for years and it's out in the open and exposed to elements. Batteries are like the elements, but fast forward. In the presence of battery acid, you get a whole bunch of uh, uh, corrosive tendency, you know, all in one place real quick. What I like to do is I'll do a terminal like this and then put those uh, cleaned up and trim back cables on there. And then I like to go and take a little shop towel and I'll rip it from one side to the center and then I'll wrap it like you saw there. And then I use ceramic engine paint. Why do you use ceramic engine paint? Well, I'm glad you asked. The reason why I use ceramic engine paint is that it's designed to be in the engine compartment. The heat doesn't mess it up. It doesn't flake it, break it, make it go away. It just works. So that's what I do. I like to use red for the positive and black for the black. My favorite kind of ceramic engine paint. What is it? Well, I'm glad you asked because <laughs> I'd love to tell you. I've used this several different kinds and my favorite Sadupa color. Uh, it looks like this. It's a 500 degree paint. Your engine usually runs at about 180 to 200 degrees Fahrenheit. So 500 is plenty, you know, for a battery terminal. Um, I use Ford Red. That's the pretty brilliant red that you saw there. And I use Gloss Black for the other one. That's this one right here.